Uh, hello, my name is Fernando Guerrero. Uh, I am interested in petroleum engineering, and this is my presentation. Uh, right here we have the product. This is what we were redesigning. It's a pig flashlight. Uh, it was cheaply made, not very good materials, and sometimes it had little to no light. And uh, right here, this is what the inside of the flashlight looked like when we did a disassembly of it. Here's the gears. Under the gears was a generator that uh, got the energy whenever you crank the flashlight. Uh, here's the gear ratios and stuff. Uh, right here's the specs table. We did some interviews to see what uh, some of the customer needs were. Uh, most of them complained about the uh, light brightness, so we decided to make it go up to 100 lux. Uh, they didn't really say anything about the weight, so we didn't we didn't really do much with it. The sound was something that uh, we also didn't really get complaints from. And uh, so one of the things that we decided to increase was the, the light duration from four to four to six seconds. And uh, most of the uh, interviewers said the crank force actually felt good and it relaxed them. Uh, this is the black model, uh, black box model. We, some of the output, I mean inputs, to produce light was electricity and hand energy, uh, which led to outputs like the light and sound and vibration from the flashlight itself. This is the energy flow diagram. It shows the movement of energy when uh, producing the light. It starts off with the human energy, which is whenever you use your hand, to mechanical energy, and then it goes to electrical, and then it produces the light energy. Right here's the final sketch. We didn't really change the uh, design of the pig. We just added more features like a waterproof co uh, cover so you could maybe use it in the rain and stuff, a compass in case you get lost, adjustable strap, a switch blade. Uh, we decided to add a laser and a UV light, and uh, we did, we put speakers on it, a smaller handle for a better, uh, a better crank force. And uh, we really just wanted to make it more of an outdoor uh, survival kind of flashlight. That is all, thank you.